let's lighten things up a little bit. Let's do this Arizona governor candidates. This is from last Wednesday. It was a candidate debate on PBS. To be fair, it is cut up into very tiny segments, which makes these people um, seem crazy. But also, to be fair, they're crazy. <laughs> and none of these phrases um, set in context make them look any less crazy. Now, you could vote for one of these or enable one of these people by winning, by not voting for their Democratic opponent, and argue this is going to lead to a good outcome. But be prepared to walk me through that. Close my business down. But you know what? I didn't listen. I kept it open. You didn't have to listen, people. You didn't have to listen. <laughs> I'd actually like to ask everybody on this stage if they would agree we had a corrupt stolen election. Raise your hand. That would happen. HB wait, 2280. Let hold on. Solved. Let her finish, please, Scott. Okay. God, they talk over me, and I'm Italian. That shouldn't happen. <laughs> you know what? I'm Irish. Okay. You know what? <laughs> Why not get high-tech people that are going to be on the machines that are Republicans. A Democrat, Republican, get supervisors, that, that, equal amount. That happens. That, that we, we have parties <laughs> looking over that's election right. results. They're, they're doing it now. No, no. They, they they're actually telling they people they have that not. hundreds, 200,000 minimum ballots were trafficked by mules. No. An honest because, election. May I finish? Mamma mia. We I have feel like scale. I'm on an SNL skit here. Are you we going to take control of the debate? We are taking, no, it? no, no, Carrie, I don't want I'm you to try. I'm happy to, to take, do it. I know you would be okay. happy to do it. Listen, I haven't been on a stage with this many women since I've been to a baby shower. It's been a while. I, I don't know how that's going to go over, Scott, but we'll let that hang. Um, <laughs> yeah. let's talk about what? Do you think Republican voters want a candidate who doesn't even believe in the vote? I don't believe this primary has been fair. I can tell you that. Otherwise, I wouldn't have launched the lawsuit. Our campaign is a movement. We're going to show up and vote in droves. They're going to have to cheat even harder in order to try to win this. Your so campaign's I think a psyop. Uh, pa, 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 please. First of all, put pa, everything. Pa, 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 pa. I feel like pa, this is please. a spoof, honestly. Go ahead. Finish what you were saying, please. Oh, <laughs> is God. this a spoof, Ted? No, it's not. Finish what Are you sure? Yes, Finesse. I am. Finesse. Wow. Okay. okay. I'm pro life. Yeah. From conception to death. And I believe no exceptions we, for rape or incest. Well, that's a gray area. I, I don't know. That's a personal decision for a person. Why can't we treat human life in the same way that we would treat alien life that know. we discovered how on would, an alien how planet? Would you? There's a reason we don't always invite Scott because he's polling at zero percent. No, one percent. This is what happens. But the polls you... lie, <laughs> Scott. Please. <laughs> and we, no, you can't <laughs> respond to a closing statement. <laughs> the only kind of drag I've ever dressed in is a business suit or construction work clothes. I've never aspired to be Elvis Presley. That's a shame. All right, that's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> What, a construction worker or work clothes? So he's a construction worker and a businessman, and if he gets a few more different drag outfits, he can be the full, uh, he can do the full YMCA song. I like accusing another Republican of being a psyop. Oh, yeah. Because, like, that, that, it's not, they're probably not running to be a psychological operation on the public. They're probably up running to, like, take the seat yeah. <laughs> for someone else. I don't know. Jay Money, uh, Arizona in here, these candidates are all indeed crazy, not just for these crazy clips, but because none of them have a plan for managing water to ensure we can all continue to live in a desert. The Democrats both have decent plans. The next election will decide whether we actually acknowledge and face an existential threat in our state. So Don't vote for the status yeah. quo, man! <laughs> if, if an abortion is a personal decision for a person, maybe we found common ground. It is... Um, really also it, that d demonstrated to me the line between like this conservative movement or how it's manifesting itself and trolling is just so blurred right because i have no idea they're all just like these 4chan edge bro types and all they can the only thing they know uh, the only way they know how to communicate their ideas or their politics is through just abject cynicism and and hatred um and, and so, like, I don't even know what the Italian point was, really, but I think it's m meant to mock the fact that people identify as other races, right? No, that was, like, an old-fashioned, like, I want to turn out people based on ethnic appeals thing. Because, like, I think, right? Like, the other guy was saying, I'm Irish. Like, I think they like... I don't know if it's, like, specifically to, like, Italians or Irish people in Arizona, but I think they just think, like, that's the way politicians speak. I, I, I don't think it's either. 
I honestly think that that is just they the were personal weirdos. Just personal weirdos. I mean, I, I you know, like ah, uh, mamma mia. <laughs> no, no, honestly, I really do think that. Like, I mean, I grew up. At, people were very conscious of like, I'm Irish, I'm Italian. Yeah. And every Andrew Cuomo just endorsed that woman. <laughs>